Hello, my name is Rob, and today I'm going to show you how to run a gift issuance and redemption on your Clover terminal. So the first thing you want to do is log into the Factor 4 app from your home screen. So you already have it brought up. So what you're going to want to do is enter in all of your information. This can all be found in My Merchant Admin. So the client number is associated with the, uh, your, the ISO. The location is merchant specific. And the terminal for most merchants is going to be 99, but again, you can find that in My Merchant Admin. And you can use the employee number and the password for whichever employee you feel like that you wanted to set up in MMA. All right, so now we're signed in and have gotten to this screen. We're going to want to hit the button here in the middle because it's very important to make sure that the Factor 4 app stays open throughout the, all of your transactions. Because um, if the app closes and you try to run a gift card uh, transaction, it will not process correctly. So as long as the app is signed in, you will be fine. So we're going to go ahead and hit the button here in the middle. It brings us back to the home. Um, so we're going to run a test transaction for an issuance. So you're going to hit the register button. And you can see here that we have gift card as some of our selections. So what I'm going to do is hit the gift card button here. And we're going to do it for $10. Set price. So you can see on the left hand side there that there's a gift card for $10. So I'm going to go ahead and hit pay. And we're going to pay with exact change in cash. So I'm going to hit the $10 button here. And if you notice down here, the, and hit the pay cash. Now it brought us over to the Factor 4 app. So what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to take our handy dandy gift card that already has a barcode printed on the back. And on the back of the terminal, there is a trigger that will allow us to scan the card. Okay. So you can see that we scanned the card number into the app. I want to click the transaction type to go to issuance. Enter in the $10 amount. Done. And make sure that it's set to US dollars. We're going to run the transaction. And here's your confirmation. Um, if you would like, you can hit print and it will print from your Clover printer. In this case, we're just going to hit cancel. And I want to go ahead and hit the home button again. And we hit the register. And this will now let us print the receipt through Clover again. So this will be the, the transaction receipt. Um, again, if we have the, the printer set up, you can use it. Or you can have it sent to an email or a text message. I'm just going to go ahead and hit done. So that is how you do a issuance. So now let's do a redemption. So we have $10 on our card. And we're going to use it to purchase some pizza. So here I, I have pizza set up already for $8.50. So I'm going to go ahead and hit the pay button here in the bottom. And now if you notice here in the bottom middle it says F4 gift. That's the app that will allow us to redeem off of the card. So I'm going to go ahead and click that. And you can see on the top there it says $8.50 already and it's blinking next to the card number. So I'm going to do the same thing. Pull the trigger in the back and scan in the card. There we go. So now we see the full card number and the amount. So we're going to hit accept. It is going to process and should show us the same screen. Oh, done. Okay, so now we're going to hit the middle button again. Back up to register. And we can see here that the subtotal was 850, but we used the F4 gift for 850, bringing the balance to zero. So we can do the same thing with the receipts, either email, text, or print off of your Clover printer. We're just going to click Done. And Cancel. Alright, so that is how you go about running a gift issuance and redemption off of your Clover terminal using Factor 4.